Hello everyone, uh, welcome to a new uh, story that I want to share with all of you and all this uh, part of the new experiments that I'm going to do on this channel uh, trying to get you a more uh, lively uh, videos. So uh, experiments do, uh, using different tools. So uh, forgive me for the mistakes I make here. So today uh, I want to tell you about a very interesting uh, story uh, that uh, has uh, uh, taken place and that is Brahmo's uh, supersonic cruise missile, especially the air version, the, the air launched cruise missile, the LCM, has become the first indigenous missile to, to receive uh, something called as a fleet release clearance fleet release clearance. So uh, this is uh, a very important certification FRC that the BrahMos missile has got and this was granted to the missile uh, recently on uh, June 10th uh, during a very high level meeting uh, uh, wherein uh, representatives from DRDO, uh, from BrahMos Aerospace and uh, from AST of Indian Air Force and SDI at another uh, Indian Air Force wing and also from the certifying agency Semilac Center for Military uh, Airworthiness and Certification. So all these uh, people were there and uh, it's a very very critical, it's a very significant milestone for the air version of BrahMos. So uh, let me just uh, take you through, uh, you know, what does uh, this mean? So, uh, according to officials whom, with whom I spoke to, uh, the FRC, that is a fleet release clearance, paves way for the IAF squadrons to use BrahMos LCM during various combat missions. And uh, this is uh, also a very important milestone for the missile maker, that is BrahMos Aerospace. As most of you know that uh, uh, BrahMos has been integrated onto Sukhoi and the number uh, 222 squadron uh, has been restricted uh, based out of Air Force Station uh, Tanjavur and that was in January and so the Sukhoi is fitted with Brahmos are already there so uh, you know it's a huge advantage now for uh, IAF's operations in the Indian Ocean region. So uh, uh, what does this FRC mean? The fleet release clearance mean to the missile? Uh, for all of you who are following aerospace and defense programs, you can compare this with something like the uh, initial operation clearance. The initial operation clearance IOC given to the Tejas. That means there will be yet another clearance uh, will be given to this missile for advanced operations uh, by Indian Air Force. As of now, FRC means uh, that uh, the Sukhois that have undergone major modifications to integrate the missile, all a few set of a few Sukhois have been given the mandate of uh, given this FRC so that they can continue with the the you know various operations that are mandated. I understand in future there will be something like a final operation clearance as well, like FOC which is given to Tejas. So this will also come uh, a, another set of FRC wherein. Uh, uh, the Sukhois will be able to uh, then undertake advanced missions. So uh, more number of Sukhois will be fitted uh, uh, with Brahmos. That will uh, that's another uh, feature. So uh, you know it is uh, it is a very significant uh, milestone for the for the uh, you know for the uh, this uh, Brahmos missile. It's a very inspiring uh, missile program, as all of you know. And uh, I also uh, understand that, uh, uh, you know, uh, this has set the benchmark for a lot of other indigenous weapon systems. Uh, uh, for instance, the Astra uh, Beyond Visual Range Missile. And you also have the Rudram 1, 2, 3, and then the new generation anti-radiation missile, NGAR. All these missiles will, all, all these missiles will also now go through this uh, fleet release clearance uh, certification that is what i uh, came to understand so it's good news for uh, indigenous uh, weapon programs 
because they are getting into advanced uh, roles. Uh, I have uh, actually written a story uh, about the same uh, uh, in on Manorama, uh, which I'll be sharing the link in the description. I hope you guys uh, enjoy this new avatar of mine in this channel. Please do feel free to comment and give your feedback, good, bad, ugly, whatever it is, so that I can correct myself. Thank you for watching this uh, experimental video. Uh, stay safe, uh, stay blessed. Jai Hind.